Hello students, this is Swati Deshpande teacher. Today I will be taking few more sums, important sums from examination point of view, fifth standard scholarship mathematics section. Chalo, start karte hai. Perimeter of a rectangle is 34 cm. If length of the rectangle is 3 cm more than its breadth, then find the area of the rectangle. Okay, perimeter they have given as 34 cm, right? This is a rectangle. Let's draw it. 34 cm is the perimeter. We don't know length, we don't know breadth. They are saying length is 3 cm more than breadth. But if we don't know the breadth, how will we find out length? So first assume breadth as x and length is 3 cm more than breadth. So this will be x plus 3, this will be x plus 3. I am purposely not writing b for breadth here because sometimes it is misunderstood as 6 in a hurry. So avoid using b, use x. Okay, now uh, we need to find out the value of x with the help of this perimeter. We know the formula of perimeter of a rectangle. Perimeter of a rectangle is 2 times length plus 2 times breadth. So, perimeter they have given 34. 2 times length. Length is x plus 3. Breadth is 2x. Right? B is x. And 2 to hai either. Thik hai. Chalo, start karte hai. 34 is 2 into. Now, this entire bracket is multiplied by 2. So, x will be multiplied by 2. Plus 3 also will be multiplied by 2. So, 2x plus 6 plus 2x. Now, x, x. साथ में लेते हैं और 6 को वो साइड भेजते हैं सो इट विल बी माइनस 6 एंड दिस विल बी 4x लेट्स राइट हियर 34 minus 6 is equal to 4x सो दिस इज 28 is equal to 4x सो so 28 अपॉन 4 इज x दैट इज इक्वल टू 7 7 सेंटीमीटर इज द x सो नाउ वी नो द ब्रेड राइट so, breadth is equal to 7 cm. So, how much will be length? x plus 3, that is 7 plus 3, 10 cm. Once we know the breadth and the length, it is so easy to find out the area. Area is length into breadth. Length is 10, breadth is 7. So, this is 70. After that, what you will write here, we will decide whether you are going to take 2 marks in your pocket or gone. Because area, area may units is always in squares. If you just write 70 centimeter, everything is wasted. We can't afford to lose marks, right? So, we need to pay little more attention to the units. We might give first option or any option as 70 cm. 70 they can choose karte hai bachche lo. 70 cm is not same as 70 cm square. Right? So, this is very very important. Chalo, aage bachte hai. Students, read the next sum properly. Sima took 22 days leave starting from 26 December. On which date would she be resuming duty? Okay. Total how many days? 22 days vacation or leave. Right? Starting from 26th December. So we need to find out. December mein kitne din chutti pe di? From 26th. Here again students reading part. After 26, on 26, from 26, whatever is given in the question that you need to understand properly. Because 8 days the other ho gaya, the answer will be different. Right? So reading part is very very important. From 26 means up to 25 she was working. Right? So how many days? Total days of December 31. Usme se 25 she was not on leave. So, 6 days of December, she was on leave. 
Here, 26 being towards the end of the month, you can find out like that also. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. 6 days. That way also you can count. But in case it is in the middle of the month, then this method is very useful. Total number of days of that month, kabhi chutti pe nahi thi. Till the previous day, 25. That you need to minus. So remaining days she will be on leave. Right? Now, 22 days may say 6 days over. So how many are remaining? 16 days are remaining. So these are of December. Jan ke kitne din? 16 days more. So 20, 22 days are over. Up to 16th Jan, she will be on leave. Here again reading part, what they have asked you is very very important. So up to 16, she will be on vacation, she will be on chutti. So next day, that is 17th Jan, she will resume office again. Correct? Very very important. Students make a mistake and 16th le lete hai. 16th may be there as one of the options. Please be careful. They are not asking you which is the last day of her vacation. No. They are asking on which day she will resume duty. So after this 16th, next day, 17th Jan, she will resume duty. Right? Very, very interesting. Hey, Gini. Revise karo fir se. It, you should be thorough in this calendar. Chalo, aage badke. Students, read the next sum. 11 bottles are filled with a total of 1111. That is 1111 milliliter of oil. How many milliliter of oil each bottle will contain? Okay. Total oil how much? 1111 milliliter. How many bottles? 11. This sum I have deliberately taken because here students make mistake in division. See, 1111 ml oil is there which we are filling or distributing in 11 bottles. When we distribute anything, we need to divide. So, 1111 divided by 11. While doing this division, many students make mistake. Let's go ahead with the division. 11 ones are 11. So, 0, 0. After that, only this one will come down. Please be careful. Two ones, both the ones won't come down. Only one. Only one one will come down. Right? One digit at a time. So, 11 is bigger, 1 is smaller. So, can't do anything. So, 0 should come here. When I give 0 here, then only this another one can be relieved. Then only it will come down. Now, 11 ones are 11. This one zero will decide whether you are going to get two marks or no. Simple division. But still students do like this. 11 ones are 11. 0, 0. Then 11 ones are 11. 0, 0. 11 and 11 will be there as one of the options. Please be careful. This is wrong. It has to be done this way. And just, I am worried about this zero here. That is the reason I have taken this sum. I don't want you to make this silly mistake. If this type of sum comes in the examination. Okay, students, you all know I can just go on like that. But we need to stop here. I will come with the next video. But before that, in case you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please do so. I will be coming with the next Videos which will clear most of your concepts before the examination. Right? Okay. And even if you like my videos, let me know whether you like it or no. Comment on the uh, videos. Okay? That will encourage me to make more and more videos. Right? No? Okay. I will come with the next video very very soon. But chalo, till then what are you supposed to do?
study well and very important thing is yes enjoy study bye